What is up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new Dragon Ball Legends video on Dragon Ball Central. Today, guys, we're going to be hopping in on the Ultra Space Time Summit number six in search of Gotenks and Gotenks alone. Now, there is a reason for that. We're going to talk about that in tomorrow's video when I sort of discuss why you guys probably shouldn't be summoning on this unless you're a fan of Majin Buu, Gotenks, and Deborah. But let's just go ahead and get right into the summons. So obviously, guys, we got a whole bunch of yellow summons to do. We got our daily discounts, and uh, we're going to start off strong, hopefully, on the Master Pack of Five Potter Destroyed Namek. That's already looking pretty crazy, man. Um, if we can start things off by pulling a Sparking as, a, as just a normal daily, I'd be very happy. But you know what? This is uh, this is kind of unexpected. I definitely... I figured, I figured we were for sure going to get a hero starting off but it's gonna be an extreme it will be an extreme tn okay so we're gonna get a five star limit break on i'm actually not bad because as you guys know i'm trying to get all of my extremes as highly limit broken as possible mainly because i think that i'm gonna do some fun videos of them down the road you know there's a lot of extremes in the game right now that are pretty fun to play but uh definitely not as competitive as most of the other characters in the game so you know we'll probably be doing like a maxed out sort of spotlight on some of them at some point but uh right now yeah it's just not looking too good man it will be a hero napa so not even gonna bother with that one because i've been let down for weeks now by the ultra space time summon number five but with that said guys we've got legends rising yellow summon let's see what happens again we want janemba out of this one okay guaranteed extremer above tell me more tell me more game what what do you want to say what do you want to say hey that's uh that's a pretty good clash right there we got that big text all right what's it gonna be what's it gonna be what's it? it's gonna blow up in the middle okay so we basically have an extreme right now but it was looking better than an extreme in the beginning there um we got an android 17 not bad not bad we're working up towards the uh the five star limit break on that dude as well um or six star limit break rather actually uh we already have him at five stars but with that said guys now we've got the ultra space i'm summon number six by the way they decided not to give us 30 percent tickets instead of the uh the normal ultra ticket summons so I'm, I'm pretty happy about that gotta shout them out on that because you know just like i call them out on every bad thing they do in this game when they do positive things like not take rewards away from us makes me very happy you know makes me very happy so uh guys ideally right now i'm gonna be pulling for go tanks if i get go tanks i will not be summoning any more on the banner basically I doubt that we're going to get him, though. He's got a 1% shot. You know, as you guys know, go over to the Z power list. You can see exactly what's going on here. And again, they go back to the EX. It's only having a 0.8% chance there. That's just, this is not good, man. It's just not good at all. So, uh, yeah, you basically are not going to get Gotenks most likely. Um, with that said, I want to say maybe 50 of the people watching this video will probably have pulled Gotenks with their first summon. So, you know, that's that's a pretty crazy thing. We're not going to spend all of our Chrono Crystals today. Just a few of them. See if we can get lucky and maybe pull a Gotenks. That is our goal right now. We got a 3-potter. So, already uh, a Super Saiyan 3-potter, actually. So, we're starting to look a little bit better. We're starting to look a little bit better. We're still not looking great, but we're looking a little bit better here, you know? We got that extreme text. I was hoping we would see something a little bit different there, but that's okay. Oh, the overpower. We got that one in five, baby. One in five versions of this summon will be pulling Gotenks. Okay, look. Look, dude. I don't want you. Nobody wants you. Just go home. Just go home, Goldo. Just go home. Look, I, I came here for one thing and one thing alone. I want that Gotenks, dude. I want that Gotenks, dude. Extreme second form still not bad. Not bad. Hero Krillin. I didn't know he was in there. That's interesting. Android 20. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, baby! First summon! What, 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 what? Are you kidding me right now? Are you kidding me right now? What? 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 Oh my god. This just like made my week, dude. I can't even freaking... <sighs> Oh my god! Oh my god! <sighs> Holy! <laughs> yeah! Baby! That is what we want! Oh god, can I make this a double and pass out on camera? 
Whew. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, dude. I can't even believe my eyes right now. Wow. All right, here. You know what? I'll tell you what, guys. I'll tell you what. We'll do one more consecutive just because I don't want to just do one single consecutive for a whole video. That, that would just be kind of a bummer. But like, oh my God, dude. Go tanks, dude. Yeah, baby. That is what I'm talking about. You guys know. You guys know I spent over 20,000 Chrono Crystals on Super Saiyan 2 Gohan to finally get him. And I get lucky on two banners in a row. We pulled Gogeta, the one character I really wanted out of the last banner, the Legends Rising banner. And then we pulled Gotenks out of this one. You've got to be kidding me, man. The one dude, the one percent chance that I had and I pulled him. Okay, we'll do one more consecutive. One more and we'll see what happens. Again, I'd like to pull Tabora. I'd like to pull Majin Buu. That's a five potter destroyed Namek Super Saiyan. What is going on right now? What is going on right now? Again, guys, want to reiterate that most of you will not get as lucky as I just did a guaranteed sparking. What? Hold on, boys. Hold on, boys. It's going in right now. It's going in right now. We got the overpower. What is going on, dude? What is going on? We got a Raccoon. We got a Gabba. We got a Jace. A Chiaotzu, a Kid Goten, actually like a super dope pull because Kid Goten's really good and actually going to feature in a video I'm making very soon. We got Cyberman, dude, and the sparking will be a Piccolo. All right, so we had to get we had to get jabbed at a little bit by the game there. That, that's kind of expected at this point, guys. Uh, so that's what most of you will be getting instead of a Gotenks is uh, a Piccolo, just because that's how the game works sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Um, that's, that's what they've done with this banner. It's what they've chosen to do. They've decided to make us likely to get a, uh, a basically completely outranked, outdone character that's far past his usefulness. So, uh, you know, he's, he's still okay, especially with the regen team now becoming a thing. Um, so I guess we're probably not going to be getting Dubora unless I pull him from an ultra ticket summon, but I might buy the starter pack. Which, if you guys don't know, there's a, uh, a starter pack now that inc includes Majin Buu good. I figured it was going to be Tabora since, again, uh, if you go over to him, I was talking about this the other day, but there's, like, nothing that can be attributed to him as far as tags are concerned. If you actually look at him, he has no tags. He does have a really interesting blast arts there. It's actually a paralysis uh, blast arts, which is really interesting. Also includes a special arts card or a, a special skill card or whatever you want to call it, but... A, a special it's a it's a extra arts special skill arts whatever again whatever you want to call it oh i just lost my voice dude oh what a worthy thing to lose it on though um but yeah guys let's go ahead and do a couple more consecutives we're going to be doing the master pack ticket summons we just got from the most recent pvp season got to rank 50 top 10k so i got quite a few rewards as you guys well know at this point destroyed dynamic one potter i mean it could turn into something decent we got that good clash the good neutral clash and that's going to be guaranteed extreme or above. We already knew it was going to be that, though, with the, um... Oh, overpower. We got a guaranteed sparking, my dude. Dang, we are just killing it with summons these past couple days. Like, actually, just ridiculous summons. Hero Goku and a second form Frieza and... Fused with Nail Piccolo and extreme will be Chiaotzu and... Final form Frost. Alrighty. Jaco there. All right. Not exactly excited about him. Cyberman. Okay. Okay, I can get hyped for some birder action, man. Let's do it. Nappa, and then our sparking will be Super Saiyan Vegeta. Is this a six star now? I think he's a six star now, isn't he? Five star. Okay, sorry. I, I thought that I had him a few higher stars than that. I thought I had him at a five star already. But uh, yeah, I guess we got a few copies of him yesterday. We got a copy of him today. So now he's a five star. Not bad. You know, hey, we will absolutely take it for free. Again, literally just for my time which uh increasingly loses value so you know that's fine man uh three potter right there base form no destroyed namic we will have a good neutral clash though and big text okay so we're still looking like we're okay we're still looking okay we're gonna get overwhelmed and goku has died okay so goku got absolutely murked there we're probably not looking at a very good multi but that's okay 
Extreme Mercenaries out. You know what, Gordo? You know what? You might have blessed me with go tanks today. I'm not going to yell at you this time, man. I'm not going to yell at you. I know what I know that's what you want. I know that's what you want, dude. You you love. You love it, dude. But I will not yell at you today. I'm not going to yell at you. Just go home. Get some rest, man. We'll see you another day. We got that Android 20. That's actually kind of dope. We want as many of him as we can get. Got some more Z medals as well with that Krillin who I have maxed out. Dodoria and Dodoria and another extreme to end things off will be Mercenary Tau. Oh, no. I thought that we were done. Okay. Captain Ginyu to end things off. Okay. So, uh, not really that bad of a summon. Not a great summon, but, you know... It, it's getting us closer and closer to having limit breaks on some things that we definitely want limit breaks on. Admittedly, you know, going to five stars on Android 20 would absolutely be fantastic. I would be very happy about that because he's a good support for the Android team. Even if you don't want to use him, he's a pretty decent support, especially with someone that doesn't have all the best Androids like I do. You know, I've got some of them, but I don't have all of them. So, you know, I, I think that that was a really solid video, guys. I got to say, I am like just dumbfounded that i didn't have to go like super far in to get go tanks dude i i am so happy you guys don't even know now that said he is purple i don't know how that fits into the current meta i think that as time goes on it'll become less of an issue but right now you know there are some really good yellows in the meta um now the most meta things like the the regen team featuring janemba and now uh good majin Buu, and then go ten um in go tanks and super saints you gohan and then the the other most meta team going to be the um the fusion team um eventually but you know right now it's gonna just feature our buddy gogeta on a normal saiyan team i mean there are some really really good yellows in the in the meta right now we've obviously got super vegeta who's going to be on the saiyan team we've obviously got 18 who's going to be featured on the android team on the regen team i mean i don't think there are any any major threats other than dkp but i guess dkp is a threat enough to consider a double purple team a little bit ridiculous to run so i don't know just looking around you know there are some threats but i don't know if it's entirely going to be the most seriously we'll take them you know i think that maybe the next banner or the next banner after that we're going to see another power creeped yellow come out and then we're probably going to be hurting as far as using a double purple team but right now we might actually make it work so we can maybe use gotenks and super saiyan 2 gohan which would be really fantastic don't you guys just love when your uh your, your camera just, just clicks out on you just just says no nah, i don't i don't feel like it anymore i just don't feel like it well for some reason, whenever I record right after I turn on my PC, which, you know, as as you guys know, I, I record as soon as I possibly can after new updates like this, you know, the new banner and all that coming out. It, it just seems to have some issues, you know, doing its job. So we'll try to figure that out in the future. I'm not exactly sure what the solution is, but sorry about that. I'm glad you didn't lose my reaction to Gotenks, though. That that managed to make it into the main video. But, guys, that is going to be about it for this one. I will see you very, very soon for the next one. Just want to reiterate here before the video ends that uh, you guys cannot expect to have the same exact results that I do when I summon because of averages, because of deviation away from the averages, standard deviations away. And basically what that means is that on average, you're going to pull a thing by a certain amount of of chrono crystal spent a certain amount of summons that you've done but some people will fall very very far away from that on either side of the average okay so you're gonna have people like me that occasionally has to spend over twenty thousand chrono crystals to get one copy of a certain character okay on the other side of things you have my last two summonings for the latest banners where i've gotten literally exactly what i've wanted in only one multi so all around, you know, that's just how it works as far as having averages and having just a chance of pulling a thing. There's going to be the average. There's going to be deviations away from the average. And you don't know where you're going to fall until you summon. So, you know, whereas, again, you know, occasionally people like me are going to have to spend over 20,000 Chrono Crystals to get something that I want. Sometimes you're going to get lucky. Sometimes you're going to get it in your first multi. Sometimes you're going to get it in your first daily. Again, about 50 of you guys watching this video, if I'm right, about how many people are going to be watching this video overall, will have most likely pulled a, uh, a Gotenks with your first daily, which is insane to say. But you know what? That's how it is. That's the, that's the average. Those are the odds. So 
that's going to be about it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. Again, I really, really do appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you guys for a Gotenks showcase very, very soon. I will see you in the next one. Until then, peace.